Geeks is welcome to Previewed, where friends don't let friends surprise me alone. I'm Adam. And I'm Jay. And today, once again, we're going <clears> to <throat> surprise Jay. Now, usually I would space this out a little bit more, because we did this video last week. Yeah. But something came in that's a little time sensitive, so I figured we should do it now. Plus, somebody else sent me something else, and it's so good, I can't sit on it any longer i i need i need okay so there's two things there's in this two one? things maybe you said there was only gonna be one i did you I, said we I, weren't I, gonna overload our audience surprise <laughs> <Confetti! laughs> <laughs> so jay has no idea what we're about to watch i do i set this up though i have not watched these things all the way through are you prepared for more happy happy fun surprises probably not you guys know what it is? Because I probably wrote it in the titles. It better not be chicken. It's not. It's not chicken. It's not chicken. It it's, not it's, be, not it be, it's not anime. It it's not chicken. Better, better not be inappropriate anime. It's not inappropriate anime. There's no nacho flavoring in this one. There's not, well, none of nacho that. Nacho flavoring is always welcome. Oh, okay. <laughs> I mean. But there isn't any in this one. Let's be real. Is there, any, is there any better cheese than nacho cheese? The answer is yes. But also. Cheddar? I, it was more of a rhetorical question. I don't ask. Well, the answer's cheddar. I don't ask. I don't ask you food questions. <laughs> Better cheddars, cheese its All right. No, 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 no. All right, let's here, here, let's here we go. surprise me. Here we go. We're, we're surprising Jay. Here we go. Jay, close your eyes just in case. Yeah, I'm not looking this app at the title of the, the video. Title of freaking thing, because even though I did change name to something else, here we go. Can I open my eyes? Yeah. Let's just start with what you were doing before the event this evening. I was bribing a motorcycle cop. You were bribing a police officer. Indeed. Not for the first Jeez, time. And yeah. up until recently, you consulted for the LAPD. <laughs> and you also claim that you're the devil. Was the devil. God, now. Well, nearly. And how old would you say you are again? So one time works very differently in hell, so... He's just sensitive about his age. I mean, even I don't know the real number. It's time for you to assume your place on Father's throne. What's the rush? Becoming God is a big job. Maybe he doesn't want to go in half cocked. I should definitely be full cocked. And I need your help. I thought I wasn't your therapist anymore. But look at what's happened. The world has no God. Clearly, I belong on this couch. Lucifer, what is that? That is my throne. Something I can help you with? Want to help me destroy Lucifer Morningstar? The laws of nature are breaking down, and the apocalypse is nigh. Apocalypse. There's only one thing we can do. Vacation in Colombia. Beautiful beaches, mountains of illicit drugs. None of us know exactly how it's going to end. He was like that when I found her. Never bring a knife to a devil fight. This is the longest trailer of all time. She can go on forever. I'm ready. I hope so. Because I make quite the entrance. And. <gasps> Behold. Beneath it. No! The shark. Behold. No! Behold. No! no! The murder. How the dare you? From Morningstar. Did not see this coming. See, it's coming out next week. I needed to get this out. Jay, what are you talking about? Adam, this is the it's Adam. It's, it's, Adam, it's so good. It's so we good. We were not. We were actually not. We did not plan on recording today. And you specifically told me that I needed to come over because we had a surprise Jay that was very time sensitive. Mm -hmm. And I have never felt more betrayed. Oh really? By you. No. How dare you? What? How dare what? you? Another Lucifer trailer? Well, it's probably the last oh, one. It's the last oh, one. Oh, it better be. There are no... This is you the last watch season. that trailer. Woof, a, he's God now. Yes! Come it on. It was a climactic battle in the last no. season. It was so good. No. Dude, I'm telling you, dude. I'm so sorry. I'm a sorry. big fan of this show. Mm, I think you're wrong. <laughs> No, it's fun. Uh, it's no. such a fun show. No. Every show like no. this deserves an animated set part I'm of it. So Supernatural did it. This yeah. did it. I'm surprised Buffy didn't do it, although Angel had a puppet episode. Come on, man. This is just plain fun. You're missing out. No. No, I'm not. 
No, I'm not. You know what I'm missing out on preview today. I'm out of here. No! <laughs> no! It's the last one. So no more loser for trailers. I swear to God, if it's not a loser for trailer, I am going to walk out of this. <laughs> no more loser for trailers after this. How dare you? Lucifer. It's a good show! <laughs> it is. It's a good yes, show! It's a good show! Please watch Lucifer, please! Well, enough people did. Yeah, they got I the guess final so, season. So it's woof, all. Woof! It's all. Woof! That looks terrible. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I'm at the therapist. Come on. Stupid. It's. I, I know, come at me in the comments, whatever. It's a good show. Just know, just know I'm reading your, I'm not going to respond to your comments uh, on, on the, I'm not going to respond to this, but just know that I'm reading them and I go, pfft. Luther's <laughs> 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 pretty good. <laughs> yeah, whatever. All right. Yeah, just All smoking right. a cigar. And just, yeah, like, just the biggest cigar. Just yeah. throwing, just reading one comment on a phone and throwing it into the water. <laughs> it up reading another comment on another phone and throwing it into the water. All right, close your eyes because this All stupid right. Apple TV app is probably going to ruin the surprise. I'm sure it will. I'm sure it will. I'm not just gonna. Hmm? Keep your eyes closed. Keep your I eyes ain't closed. looking. All right, my here. eyes aren't closed, but I'm not looking. All right, great. Here we go. And you ready? Here I'm we go. Focusing on my coffee. Here we go. All right. This Mother's Day, let Colonel Sanders take care of dinner Hold. and mom's fantasies Hold. by giving her tender wings of desire. To call their affair passionate was an understatement. Sometimes it seemed as though Madeline and Colonel Sanders had been made to love each other, and they tried to do so at every given opportunity. <laughs> as she lied in Colonel Sanders' arms, she could not help but feel as though she finally belonged somewhere, to someone. And she knew in that exact moment, what it meant to feel love. Don't you wish you were a mom? They wrote a... Oh no, 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 I got it. It's a, it, they, yeah, wrote, yeah. they wrote a thing. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I need, truly, I need to meet their marketing team. I feel like at this point we've featured enough of their products on here mm -hmm. that I feel like we've, we've earned the right to tour their facilities. Oh, yeah. And I truly think it would be, it would be just a, a far more, a far more uh, sexually charged and deranged version of Wonka's factory. Oh, you think? Because I don't know what they have going on there. Why does that exist? They hired someone. I will say this. Sure. I will say this. KFC, if you wrote a romance novel, I'm going to read it. And you better not pull any punches. Because we've all read romance novels before. Uh -huh. And if you're telling me your marketing department had someone write a romance novel, uh -huh. and it doesn't go the whole nine yards as a romance novel, mm -hmm. then what are we even doing here? Well, Jay, it's interesting you bring that up. Because I have the book, and I've already read most of it, and I've decided to give you a little sampling, as it were, of said book. So here now, I'm going to read to Jay a small sample of The Tender Wings of Desire, a book I've already read most of, and I'll tell you, it's actually quite good. <laughs> It's actually pretty good. I have not read many romance novels, but like I read this one. It's like oh, because the guys in the Discord are like guys, this thing exists. Adam, the book is real. Here's a link to the book. And I was like, Great. oh my god, got the book. Great. Read most of the book because I had this. I was like, I had to read this to you. I have to read this to you. So I found a nice little, a nice little. It's a like quick ten pages because these pages are very. You're gonna small. read ten pages. You think these pages are very small because it fits on the Kindle. You're gonna read ten pages. Well, right. Because each little half no of the one, screen. No one. All right. Well, there goes our attention. Half of the screen is only a, is a page, so it's gonna it's gonna okay. go by. I, already, I timed myself. It should take a couple minutes. All right. So here is 4J, a small sampling of the. Tender, this better not be. This the better not be. Tender wings 
I'm just, it's nothing. All like, right, you just better be appropriate. Jay, remember, we <laughs> played the game, the dating sim. I on, understand. On your Twitch. Yes. And that, this is the same vein of okay. that. Okay. It was okay. one of, the, it was like the greatest okay. thing we've ever done and it's lost to time and space. Yep. But this, so here we go, guys. Here we go. I'm probably going to have it popped up on the bottom high so you guys can read along. Anyways, here we go. For Jay. All right. A small sample. Ten pages. Tender wings of desire. She stopped walking then and stood for a long time, simply looking at each other. Madeline's heart was pounding so heavily in her chest that she did not think she would be able to breathe. Perhaps she would die like this. It would be terribly romantic, would it not, to be killed by such a longing? They were there in that moment, something that Madeline had never experienced but instinctively understood. That terrible and wonderful moment where either of them would take a step. Take a step. Break through the invisible <laughs> barrier that people, because this, this camera's oh, obstructing yeah. the screen. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me do this then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There yeah. it is. <laughs> that terrible and wonderful moment where either of them would take that step, break through the invisible barrier that people construct around themselves, and stop it all with a kiss. She could do it. She wanted to do it. She wanted him to do it. But at that point of no return, she found herself taking a step, distancing herself from him. This wasn't her. She wasn't this person. She did not fall in love at first sight. This wasn't the kind of person who eloped and ran off to die for love. That wasn't Madeline. All of this, this connection, the handsome man standing taking her for a walk, the moment of the kiss. That wasn't who she was. It never would be. I'm sorry. I can't, she said. Harlan's face crumpled into confusion. You cannot say that. I've never met a woman like you. We're standing here and we have something, I have everything at our fingertips. And you're going to walk away? No. Her heart was pounding, reacting to the notion that he was attempting to fight for her. He reached out a hand and gently touched, touched her cheek. Do not touch me. <laughs> right now, right now. <laughs> she Do not touch me. She leaned into it as though she never wanted him to stop touching her. I'm sorry, she said, taking another step back. I've made this a huge priority in my life. This whole thing that's <laughs> yeah, happening right yeah. now, I've made this a huge priority. Yeah. I've made some serious choices in my life. You did. This is a, Your choices have led to this, This Jay. is what... I woke up earlier than I wanted to today to do this. Mm -hmm. I did not want to get out of bed, but I was like, you know what? I owe it to Adam to get there. We got to bust this out. Mm -hmm. And this is the, this is the buck wild bullshit <laughs> <laughs> that he puts in front of me. Continue, please. I continue. Do not be. There was such a gentleness in his voice that she looked up, at him, looked up at him in alarm. He seemed sad and a little frustrated, a little sick with himself. And the way he looked in the moonlight was so striking that Madeline ended up closing that distance and pulling him in for a kiss. It was electric. It was everything. And whatever sickness Madeline, Madeline believed she had from her infatuation with him melted away at the touch of his lips. Her entire body felt as though it were on fire. Her heart beating wildly in her chest, he felt so warm as his arms circled around her waist to pull her closer. This was the closest she's ever been with a man. <laughs> and she would not want it any other way. She felt as if she were a woman on fire. Jay, this girl is on fire. Feverishly, at the best way possible. And something seemed to take, her o take over her when she deepened the kiss. She had no idea it could be like this. All of her thoughts and her furtive fantasies about what it might be like had never prepared her for this. Of course, she had tried to imagine it, tried to picture what it would be like kissing a boy, but she had never been able to imagine the feeling quite like this. When she tried to picture the kissing, when she tried picturing I'm kissing Reginald, just listening to you here, just talk. Do you even know how to kiss? The way you're talking about it is just like kissing. Me? Yeah. Are you saying I'm I not performing it. well with I, this? No, nah, it's just I. It's you something about to... the way you say kissing kiss. that makes me think that, like you're, you're, you're like you. I feel like the way you say it makes me think that you kiss like a baby. You know, like ah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've never been kissed yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah. The bags of sand, it. right? They feel no. like bags of sand, right? Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Anyways, I continue. I may, I'll do a little bit better talking about the kiss then. She never imagined it would feel like fire and ice and ecstasy all rolled into one. <laughs> fire and ice all rolled into one. And ecstasy. Great. Yep. Yeah, man. She was breathless. Breathless? <laughs> breathless? No. She was breathless when they parted. As she looked up at him, she saw an entirely new and a strange aspect to her of her future unfold unfettered by the life that she was expecting of her. She was technically unfettered from the expectations of her place in society. Oh boy. No longer did she have to maintain her modesty. On the contrary, she was free to be with whomever, whomever, 
Whomever she decided. Never do that sound. Ever sorry. again. I, I hated that. Whomever she decided. When, when you're reading sorry. a romance you're right. novel? You're no. Right. Don't make that sound. Yeah. No. <laughs> you're right. You've just confirmed that you don't know how to kiss properly. <laughs> yeah. Don't make me get Amanda in here. I, no. She'll tell you I'm, I, that I'm, I think she I'm might, okay at it. <laughs> I don't know. Well, I asked Amanda if Adam knows how to kiss and she burst into tears. So it's sort of fun day here at Preview Day HQ, everybody. Regardless of whether they were going to end up being her, he was going to end up being her husband. Madeline had to admit the idea of it all scared her, for she had grown up with the understanding that lovemaking was entirely at the hands of her future husband, Ugh. and that it was her duty to submit to him. Remember the six place back in the day. Many days, when the distant past. One night when she was 15, she had playfully discovered a few secret novels that her maid had hidden. Oh, it boy. spoke of fire and passion, of wanting. And although she thought it would thrilled, although the thought of it thrilled Madeline, she was... She was old enough to believe that such things could never happen to her. But she had taken comfort in the idea that it existed. Now... Is she like a nun in this? What's happening? She So she is a woman of stature who was supposed to marry some other dude that her parents picked out for Who's her. Who's been murdered. Well, she ran away. By the colonel. Well, that may happen in the future. I haven't gotten to that part of the book. Okay. But she ran away because she did not want to get mar married to a man oh, she Oh, it's a runaway love. bride situation. Yes. Okay. So she ran and has bumped into Colonel Sanders. All right. I don't know other, any other polite way to say this, but we were, are we almost done? <laughs> I'll skip ahead. <laughs> All right. I'll skip ahead. I've skipped ahead to the last page. Here we go. <laughs> she told him about Reginald, about the engagement, and about... Murder? Uh, yeah, but now, oh, maybe murder most foul? Yeah. Uh -huh. Same joke. Uh, about how she had run like a thief in the night from the idea of being a wife to a duke. Harlan listened with all of it, uh, all, with all of it with a quiet, contemplative look on his face. She did not know what that meant. I've terrified you now, haven't I? He chuckled in the darkness. No, he replied. I was just surprised is all. Come here. Harlan pulled her close and she laid her head on his chest. With his arms around her, she did not feel like uh, her... She did not feel like her past. She did not feel much like anything. Kissing a man who wasn't her betrothed was supposed to imply that she was tainted in some way. As though she'd never been spoiled for her future husband. Perhaps that might have been true. But as she drifted off to sleep, the only thing she could think of that she felt for free. She felt free. Shouldn't have done that again. Stop That's it. What I do when I speak wrong. I hate it. That she felt free. She felt in charge. She felt as though she were finally coming face to face with the wonder of her destiny. It's a pretty good book. I do. I, I, you know what? If it's you're looking for a fun read, this probably takes you know more normal people maybe it's an not, hour or two. It's not bad. This is pretty good. It's, it's pretty good. Bad. I don't know how it ends. I assume at some point uh, Reginald will show up and he and, and Harlan will have to fight. Yeah. And then Reginald gets deep fried in eleven herbs and spices. That's right. That's how. And they dine I, on his corpse. Mm -hmm. I have this book if you want it. You know, I almost respect the hustle of this to a degree. Oh! In that, when I was like, we're doing another surprise, Jay, we've literally just did one. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I, what about this is really that necessary? And I gotta admit, you brought your A-game today. So, good on you. Thanks. Also, I don't think audiobooks are in your future, homeboy. <laughs> nope, they're not. <laughs> <laughs> I, I watch. I, <laughs> <laughs> it's like, hey, how, I, you, oh, I've been listening to this new recording of Lord of the Rings. It's, it's a great thing. It's just every once in a while, I just go. <laughs> 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 I, I, is he eating a popsicle while he's reading it? I'm not, it's not clear. It's not clear to me. I, uh, yeah, I watch videos on YouTube at one and a half to two times speed, and it sounds normal to me. So, yeah, yeah reading is... Yeah, uh, you really... I think, you I, really screwed, I think you screwed your brain up with that. I did, a little bit. Yeah. I, but I, I needed to try, at least. Yeah, but you listen to audiobooks at two times speed? I would, now that I know I can do it. Ah, uh, no. That's not fun. That's why I read. I don't actually really listen to audiobooks. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I like audiobooks. I, I'm sure they're great. I just I just read... I, I, I read slower. Because I, I can read while I'm doing other things. Oh, okay. The frustrating thing about reading sometimes is that, like, you have to sit there and read. Oh, I, yeah. Well, it's I, like, I can put it in an audiobook and, like, do my chores. Oh, I can't do that. And I'm doing both things at one I, time. I need to read. That's the thing I said. It's the thing I'm doing to absorb all the information and, you know, create the world in my head. Oh, see, I actually do it, but I actually, like, create it better if I'm, like, doing other things. Interesting. Yeah. Oh. So my brain's weird. So we all learned something today. We all, yeah. 
uh, that I, uh, you know, make a disgusting sound when I have a hard time reading a thing out loud. Uh, and uh, Jay probably hates me for at least a couple of weeks. Uh, thank you guys for letting me know that this book, uh, the trailer exists and the book was real. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> this was great. I think it was a successful surprise, Jay, because uh, he hates me and probably part This one me. actually broke me a little bit. Yeah, he's like, off, and like not in a ha ha ha, but like, I think he's actually a little angry at me. Uh, but if yeah. you guys have ideas for other things that can make Jay hate me, uh, KFC, get at us. We, we're coming to your lab. I want to see it. It's, it's probably time. pretty fun. It's time. I'm also going to burn it to the ground. <laughs> it's all, it, it is all a ploy. And be like, you probably should have been making threats on your YouTube channel. Well, I am. We're coming for you. You, you wizards. And I'm going to absorb your power and then I'll be the chicken. Be the chicken. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Yeah, man. There is a Discord channel on our Discord it's called Surprise. There's Jay. a Discord channel on our Discord. Yeah. Say it ain't so. Well, there's multiple. Yeah. There's one specifically for this uh, premise. If you have ideas and fun things you want me to surprise Jay with, so that he hates me and not you, uh, <laughs> put them on in there. We'll get to them eventually. We'll probably take a little time off so Jay can, uh, you know, our friendship can heal after this. Uh, but yeah, I've been wounded by this. I'm kind of sorry, but at the same time, not. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, also, you know, if you have, you know, let Jay know how you feel about him breaking in the comment section below. Uh, also, like, subscribe, and uh, hit that bell. Do the YouTube that you do so well. Guacamole is extra. You watching the last preview video ever, weirdos you. Had a good run. Had a good run. Other videos popping up right here. Yeah. Please watch this. We would appreciate it as much as we. Appreciate you. Well, I appreciate you watching this one. I don't know about Jay, but I appreciate it. I mean, I'll take the ad revenue. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to okay. say that. I'm not going to kick that out of bed for your crackers. You know what I'm saying? But we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.